What is up, YouTube? High Tech Lab here. I am in the off grid room today. Little update we got some stuff occurring in here, some paint. We got to do some cleanup. We had a bit of a situation, but I got new lights in here. Some stuff changed. I did a new piece of pipe across the top of here, PVC with some offsets and whatnot. New pipe for new switches. Got these lights in and got a beautiful piece of conduit to the lights as you can see comes up and across down here offsets into the junction box all in one piece of pipe that was fun to bend got a little bit of a mess in here got to repaint and stuff and what i'm showing you guys today is i'm coming in here because these bus bars got covered in a layer of gunk and i'm going to go ahead i have heat shrink right here and right here this is uh, what they use for like lithium ion battery packs and i'm going to go ahead and be heat shrinking these bus bars now i believe this is only like 15 feet or something like that um, so this is an experiment to see how it goes so right now i'm actually going to pull off this bus bar across the top right here and that is a negative bar. I'm going to go ahead and give that a test with the heat shrink. I wanted to mention to you guys as I went and visited the Geek Group in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Here are some new fuses I got. I know I'm upside down, but those are 300 amp fuses. Those are going to be bolting into the bus bar here for the inverters. I also got a 2000 amp shunt. You guys can read uh, the information on that right there. I got some meters. This is DC amps and AC amps. I'll probably make this one one tenth scale. So uh, 60 amps would show as 600 amps. I have a filter and a current transformer, which I plan to incorporate the meters and whatnot into my uh, industrial control panel. I have a PLC on the way that's gonna get installed in this guy. Overall, quite a few updates to come. I got to do some more painting in here, though. It did get a little um, dirty. We had a, a situation, so no big deal. I'll keep you guys updated as we go. are now so here we are now we've got I used pretty much the last of the heat shrink there's only a little bit left I could do some stuff down here if I wanted but um here you go here's the finished product I know it's Raiders colors but oh well notched it out for the um, battery in interconnects but uh there you go now it's a lot safer and uh, Looks a lot better actually. I mean, the aluminum looked nice. I really like the aluminum, but when that's all black and that's all red, I think it'll be uh, super cool. So let's see how we did for solar today. We are doing great. We're floating. So anyway, that's today's video. Heat shrinking the bus bars. I should have painted while I had them out of there, but oh well, 
minor details. Catch you guys in the next video.